So, you want to start shopping around for quotes on a metal roof, but face one daunting question. How large is your roof? How many peaks and valleys do you have? And how do you even get up on the roof? Or maybe you're a roofing contractor and you forgot to take a measurement. You're looking for a quick way to complete your bid without having to drive back to the house. In this video, we're going to show you how to get general measurements for your roof, all while staying in the comfort of your own home. This is the Metal Roofing Learning Channel. Brought to you by Western States Metal Roofing, where you can save 15 to 50% on your materials by buying factory direct. Visit westernstatesmetalroofing.com. So, you're dying to ask for a general estimate for a metal roof, and the key question you'll get is, how large is your roof? Fortunately, the answer is just a few clicks away. Thanks to Google Earth, you can now search for your home's address and get a bird's eye view. Simply search Google Earth on your browser and click the link. Click Launch Earth and you're ready to go. On the upper toolbar, you'll simply search for your home's address and you're off. You can zoom in or out by using the scroll wheel on your mouse. Left click and drag to move around. Rotate the camera by clicking on your scroll wheel and dragging the mouse. You should start by printing out a top view of your home. Simply line up your house and click on the top right corner to print. You can print multiple angles and views. More information on your roof will always lead to more accurate estimates. It can show the supplier if there are any additional entryways or window hangs that may be needed. Now that you have your top view printed, it's time to start measuring. Frame your home back to the nice top shot. You'll want to be directly above and zoomed in as much as possible. Click the ruler icon on the left side of your screen. Switch the unit of measurement to feet. Then click on a starting point and stopping point and you'll get an estimated measure of the distance. Start logging in your measurements. This works well for straight runs. The measurement tool will not be as accurate with slopes. In these situations, it's best to angle the camera and get various measurements to see which is closest in comparison to surrounding measurements. It's always best to go outside and check a few measurements to verify that what you're getting on Google Earth is in the ballpark. Once you're done, you'll now have a general measurement of your roof that you can send to a metal roofing supplier. This quick and easy process is a great starting point for a general estimate only. Prior to ordering any material, it's crucial that you hire a professional to do the field measurements. When it comes to metal roofing and siding, an accurate list of materials is essential for proper budgeting and successful completion of installing metal panels. This is a report that is known as a takeoff. Companies like Western States Metal Roofing offer this service for free. The takeoff will include materials needed, quantity of materials needed, breakdown of pricing per each material type. Again, prior to getting a takeoff, you will want an exact measurement of your home. Check the link in the description that will explain the requirements for a free takeoff. At least for now, you can start getting general estimates thanks to Google Earth. You can find step-by-step -step installation videos and homeowner guides on our channel. And don't forget to show your support by hitting the like button and subscribe.